Yeah, I think the game evolved from um, Batador and Shuttlecock and it's said that um, somebody had the bright idea of stringing some uh, string across the hall in Babington and instead of Batador and Shuttlecock is just playing the shuttle backwards and forwards and hitting it to one another, um, you start to, when you put the string across, you start to hit the shuttle down and it becomes more competitive. And that's where I believe uh, the Babington started. The earliest documented reference to Babington was in 1863 in England. The Cornhill magazine describes Babington as Battledore and Shuttlecock played on sides with a string used to cut across the middle. Through modern technology of being able to go on to newspaper.com, we've discovered this article called The Life in the Country House was published in the Tumans Exeter Flying Post. And this establishes that Babington was called Babington in 1863. And it's published in this uh, Cornhill magazine book. And it says that um, if the weather be such to as induce you to remain within doors, your cooperation will be sought for a game of pool, comma, Babington, which is Batador and Shuttlecock, played with sides across a string suspended some five feet from the ground, or similar amusements. Sometime in the second half of the 1800s, a similar game was gaining popularity in India. We have a picture here of badminton being played in Simla in India. This is 1864 and you can see that it's a normal court as well, been marked out and uh, they're playing with quite large shuttlecocks as well. That's the earliest photograph we have of badminton being played in India. Um, this is another photograph of badminton being played in 1867 in India. Well, you can see from that photograph there, in 1864, they were certainly using a net. Um, it's slightly higher than five foot, but you can see they were using a net there. And again, in 1867, uh, they were using a net there. This is a photograph of Bampton being played in Bashar in India in 1874. Um, you can see that the courts, it's well played because the courts are worn out, the grass is worn out there. 